Hello everyone, Dan here from the Next Tissue Podcast. On today's video, we're going to open up another one of our boxes for Shadows of the Galaxy. This is box number three. Uh, the first two boxes actually have been pretty good. I've got some really good stuff. Uh, four legendaries in one, five legendaries on another one. You can go check out those videos. Uh, you can go check out those videos down in the in the description or in the channel. Uh, so let's get into that. I always forget to get my little instrument to puncture the outside plastic that's a little tougher than it looks. But once you get in it, you're in it. So let's go to the other camera. All right, here we go. Very excited. Box number three. Like I said, good stuff. Uh, I really, there's some stuff that I really want. Hey, look at that. Let me stop this from zooming in and out. Look at that. All righty then. I take this too. Okay. All right. Here we go. 24 packs. 24 packs up and down. I really wish this had like a boss popper with something, like a little promo pack or something. I think that would be neat. A lot of other games do that. All right, we're still looking for a showcase. Haven't pulled a showcase. Uh, hopefully that'll happen on stream or on these videos. Uh, but yeah, definitely every pack that I open, I'll definitely record it. Here we go. We're starting with Jabba the Hutt, a hyperspace Coronet City, Desperado Freighter. Let's get through the common cards. As you know, I'm putting aside any hyperspace and foils and all that. So we got to the uncommons. We have a mercenary gunship that's uh, hyperspace. Ooh, our first legendary right off the bat. Oh, we have Ray. I pulled a Kylo on the other one. We have our, our moisture farmer. So I can I can now play a Ray Kylo. Very bad, not optimized at all deck. So that'll be fun. Cool. Right off the bat with one of the legendaries. I like the way. That's a good way to start the box. You know, first box, first pack magic. Here we go. Ooh, Hondo, a hyperspace of Hondo. Very nice. Some common cards here. We have some uncommons. We have a rare legal authority. And then we have a pirate battle tank as our uh, foil. So every pack, if you're new to the, if you're new to the Star Wars game, every pack comes with a common card. I mean, a, a foil at, at the back. It could change rarity, rarity, rarity. Oh boy, words are hard, especially after a long day. But very excited to be recording. Oh, look at that. That's a cool one. Ruthless Assassin, Underworld. You know that. I know it's just a common, but like I think that'll be a pretty common card to play. It's got a lot of flexibility, especially with the Underworld stuff coming out. We have uh, Koska Reeves, uh, as portrayed by Sasha Banks, aka Mercedes Monet from Wrestling. And we have some Bam Braces Grapple, grapple Shot. So. So yeah, if I mispronounce any words, like I said, it's been quite a long day, so excuse that. So here we go. We have Gar Saxon, a hyperspace Gar Saxon. Very nice. Ooh, a hyperspace desperate attack. It's a pretty good card. I think that'll be solid. That'll see play. We have our own commons here. We have Kira, one a rare card, very nice. And then we have a Bounter Hunter's Quarry as our other other foil. Ooh, we let's go. Oh, Kylo Ren. I think this is my first Kylo leader. I'm gonna put that off to the side. I wanna I wanna make sure I have all the leaders. Uh, you know, so I can build whatever I want. I think I see foil, but it might be just a regular card. We'll see. We have our uncommons. We have a rare Xanadu blood. 
And uh, oh, hyperspace foil McClunky. That's pretty cool. McClunky is one of my favorite cards in the set. Uh, I'm probably not gonna trade that actually. I'm definitely gonna keep that. Uh, yeah, I I love McClunky. I don't know why. It's just a fun card. Uh, it plays really well with all the underworld stuff, of course. Uh, so yeah, I think it'll be really beneficial with Boba, Cad Bane, Jabba. Um, yeah, all that stuff. So. Okay. We have a uh, Boba Fett leader. Uh, we have a clone deserter as our a hyperspace. I think I see another hyperspace. That's nice. Ooh. It's not my favorite legendary, but it is a hyperspace. So that means it doesn't take up the place of the legendary. So I could get four in this one in theory as well. And we have a rare imprisoned and then a desperado freighter. Okay. Ooh, 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 very cool. Anything that's hyperspace immediately makes it worth more, right? Because it's they're even rarer to get. Another Boba Fett leader and a hyperspace uh, Death Watch. Now, I don't think that the stages are going to be, um, you know, I don't know. I don't know. They're going to be too valuable because they don't really add much. We have a uh, Concordon Interceptor. Evidence of the Crime is our rare card. And Covetous Rivals. I think I've had pretty good luck with the box that I pulled. Oh, I opened this face up. If this were in a showdown, I would have been not surprised at all. I would have definitely seen it right away. Just giving away the content. Palpatine's Return. That's a great rare. Definitely want to place it to that. And another rare, double rare pack. Boba Fett's armor, Palpatine's return. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent stuff. We have a Bosque leader. A hyperspace collection star hopper. Oh, I see hyperspace foil in our future. Cassian. Forlom, the scanning officer. We have another legendary here, Ruled with Respect. I don't think I had seen this one. That's pretty nice. And then we have Frozen and Carbonite as a, a hyperspace foil. I'm going to put that behind Final Showdown. Wow, we are already three legendaries in, and I don't think I'm even a third of the box into this. Uh, wow, wow, wow. Frozen and Carbonite, pretty good pull. I think that's gonna, I think that's just a really popular card. Like a lot of the stuff that has a lot to do with the, obviously the movies, big lore. It usually tends to be pretty popular, and usually tends to be pretty good cards because they want to make sure that you're you like the popular stuff, right? Ooh, we have a rare give into your anger, and a criminal muscle foil. No hyperspace at all in that pack. I guess they all can't be winners. Doki. Hondo. Another Hondo. I think now I do have... Uh, no, I'm still missing Bo-Katan, I think, as a leader. Mas Katana and a Bravado. Oh, hyperspace village of the damned, as I call it. Because they were pretty screwed there against the Empire. 
We have Zori Bliss and ooh, Hyperspace Foil Rare General Recon. That's three Hyperspace Foils. One of them is a rare. I think Hyperspace Foil is as close as you get when I, with a rare card. Is as close as you get to legendary without a card being legendary, of course. Now, hyperspace foil legendary, that's as close as you can get to a showcase. And even then, value wise, still way off. All right, we have another ray here. We have a hyperspace coming. Another McClunky hyperspace. This one's just regular, it's not foil. Very cool. Another hyperspace incoming. Stolen Land Speeder, that's one of our rares. So this is gonna be a double rare pack at least. Mix Mayfield, and put that over here. And then Wanted, double rare pack, very nice. I'm always down with a double rare pack. Alrighty. Ooh, Hyperspace Kylo Ren. Very cool. Definitely going to be playing that. All right. McClunky. I might just collect all the McClunkies. Mandalorian Armor. That's a rare card, and our foil is Pillage. Nothing too crazy there. Nothing too crazy there. Three legendary so far. Hoping for at least one more. Who knows? We got five yesterday, so anything is possible. We have another Ray Leader. Hyperspace incoming. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, very good pull here. This is a rare mall. Double mall. What is happening? If I have a foil mall behind this, that's going to be the craziest shit. Uh, it is crosshairs. Okay, so no no triple mall. Uh, that's like jackpot. Ooh, very nice. This hyperspace looks really cool. I'm going to put, actually, I'm going to put these off to the side here. I do. I feel like mall, even though it's a rare card, it's got the swagger of a legendary, right? That's crazy. Double mall in one pack. That's insane. Oh, sorry. I got too excited to start ripping the pack. Uh, uh, over here. Let's see it. Let's see it. All right. Hyperspace, hyperspace uh, on solo. Not too shabby to start with. Do we have hyperspace incoming? Maybe not. Lady Proxima. I think I finally have a set of her with this. Uh, we have Tech as our rare card. And Chewbacca as our foil rare. So double rare pack once again. That's two double rare packs in a row. With two malls, Chewie, and Tech. We are about two-thirds two of the box in. Trying to go through this relatively quickly. I know the... I just want to make sure that I oh I capture all my pulls. I don't we don't need to make this hours long. Oh, we got foil, but it might have been just the back foil. We have unrefusable offer as one of our rares, and the street gang recruiter as a, a our foil. No more, no triple rare pack. Or double, not another double ring. We didn't get the, the tricky there. All right, Boba Fett leader. Moscatana's castle. Moscatana's castle hyperspace. Put that off to the side. I think we got hyperspace incoming. Yes. Principal outlaw hyperspace. Put that off to the side. Smuggler's aid. Very nice. Oh, final showdown. A second final. Two final showdowns in this box. That's our third legendary. One of them is Hyperspace. I don't know if that's the a legendary that I'm most excited about, but I think it will see play. I think a lot of people are going to be playing Cad Bane 
uh, in double yellow. And even if you play it out of color, uh, out of aspect, it'll still I think it'll still be pretty good. So that's four legendaries in one box. Maybe not the not the hottest legendaries, but still nice to get four legendaries in one box, right? Ooh, Lando Calrissian. Okay. On comments here, the Zuckus. Dr. Pershing is our rare, and we have a lurking TIE Phantom as our uh, foil. All right, we got about five packs left. Five pack alert. Oh my goodness. This did not open as, as I hoped. Gar Saxon. Okay, on comments here, another Infus Nest. Java's Rancor, nice. We have a Django Fit. And this is a double rare pack with altering the deal. Very nice. Double rare pack. We are here for it. We have Cad Bane as our leader. Incredible stuff. A rare uh, Arcotin's Assault Cruiser and take captive as our foil. Three packs left from a pretty good box overall. I think pretty, pretty incredible box. Cad Bane, okay. We have a soup down as one of our rares, and then we have Smuggler Starfighter as our common, our foil. Two packs left. Will there be a showcase in either one of these? Let's find out. Here we go. Fennec Shan, not a showcase, but we do have Hyperspace incoming. Is it foil though? Rose, I think that's my playset of Rose now. We have a rare mystic reflection and, oh, it's not hyperspace. It was just sh really shiny. Unexpected escape. All right. And we are almost done here. Last pack magic. Come on now. Come on, man. Give me a little last pack magic. And it is another Fennec Shan. No last pack magic for the showcase. We can still get some good stuff here inside the pack. But maybe not. Maybe our... Okay. Pikes. I really think it's funny when the cards are right back to back. We have a rare stolen land speeder and <laughs> no way this is a three pike sentinel pack this is insane that's crazy why couldn't this be mall look at that we have the regular card the hyperspace and then the hyperfoil that's really funny I should sell those as a collection, like the Pokemon Evolution. All right. Well, I think that's going to do it. Let's go over some of the highlights of our trip. Uh, as I mentioned, General Recon, Hyperfoil, very good. Frozen in Carbonite, I think Hyperfoil. It's only an uncommon, but it's still, like I said, iconic scene. Personal favorite, McClunky. Hyperfoil. Then we got the double mall 
right? We got the regular mall, the hyperspace mall. And then our legendaries, we have rule with respect. We also have Ray, uh, which I really wanted one of them. We have Final Showdown and then a hyperspace version of Final Showdown. What? You know what? Not mad at this box at all. Four legendaries will always make me leave with a smile. So there you have it. Uh, let me know. What are you pulling? What have you built? Uh, and, of course, stay tuned because we will open a couple, a few more boxes. Uh, and I'll be opening packs as I play through the, uh, play through, you know, uh, just weekly play and get promo packs and stuff like that. Uh, so, yeah, very excited to see where this goes. Uh, so, if you uh, haven't subscribed, make sure to do that uh, to keep up with all our gaming content, as well as our comics, movies, all the stuff. And as always, thank you for watching, everyone. Remember to share, like, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when we go live. That is most Saturdays, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. Stay tuned. We have more comic reviews, trailer reactions, TV recaps, all that fun stuff in the channel. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.